Which part of Damien's business school is your favourite place to go? Oh, the library. The library. That's why I'm always here. Because of you. <laughs> the topic for today is me showing you around the kind of facilities that we have here in NUS Business School. So the first facility I'll be showing you is the prisoner's library that we have here. It's called the Hon Sui Sen Memorial Library, if I'm not wrong. This is the library which is closest to Business One, which is the main building where we have most of our classes. So right now, I'm actually going to the library and have a group meeting with one of my classmates, uh, Kimberly. Yeah, let's go. I like the reading room, the one with the cubicles because oh. it's like very quiet and I feel like I can do my own work there in my own time. Oh. The library. The library. Why? That's why I'm always here because of you. Oh. <laughs> so this is Potie, he's my Raffles Junior College classmate. So we met eight, eight years, years ago. ago. I, I can't believe he's here because you hardly keep in contact with your JC classmates. Well, I always see Jiang Jin around <laughs> business school I don't, from business. I don't really keep in contact with you but I always see you. <laughs> I don't know whether that counts as keeping like contact. So it is it's it's like fate brought us together. So it's not we didn't consciously put in effort to keep contact, but it's like you know okay, okay. and fate. Okay, cut cut. What do you like about the library? I like the smell of books. <laughs> do you? I love I it. I don't smell any books here, bro. <laughs> Why are you lying? Don't go, Chin. No! No! The I don't really eat here much. Oh, the Japanese food, yeah, it's quite good. My friend says 4 and 13 is good, but it's chicken katsu, right? Yeah, oh my god! The drinks here are very affordable. The ice milo here is just $1, and I think all Singaporeans are addicted to ice milo, so. That's why I'm very happy. The green coin means ice my lord. This is copio for something. Oh, the blue coin. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. So another place in NUS Business School is called the Fish Tank. I have no idea why they call it the Fish Tank because I don't see any fishes. This is where a lot of our meetings in NUS Business School is held. It's a very nice open area for group discussions to take place. So right now I'm headed to another group meeting that I have. It's for my digital marketing module and we're probably meeting in one of the classrooms at Biz 2. We are in some classroom in Biz2 now. What is your favourite place in NUS Business School? Wow, good question. I would say... Fish tank? Fish tank? Yeah. Can I ask you why is it called the fish tank? I have no idea, but that's what my senior told me. Maybe because of the glass window. It looks like a fish tank. Oh. This is one of the classrooms in Biz2. And this is actually the classroom where I had my very first class in university and the module I was taking right here is ES2002 Business Communications. Doing a video to show people what are the nice facilities that you have in NUS Business School. So what is the favourite facility that you like in NUS Business School? Kenrich Hall doesn't count. Fine, well I think the library is pretty nice, the aircon is really cool and there's plenty of seats where you can go and study. Because everyone I interviewed, right, said the library is the best place. Yes, the library is and definitely the most comfortable place to go study. Is that the only place? Yeah, pretty much. Everywhere else is kind of is kind of not very conducive. Like, it's raining right now. Oh. And, like, if you want to study outdoors, it's like you call, you're definitely going to get hit by the rain. So, it's the only place where you can really study is the library. Hello. Okay, Tati, hi. Hi. What is your favourite place in your business school? How is that an interesting favorite place? What? <laughs> it's so... Spread. What? Spread. What's spread? The cafe. <laughs> the cafe downstairs at oh, the cafe downstairs. Oh. It serves pasta, salads, sandwiches, cakes, muffins. Okay. 
<laughs> favorite place in NUS is the school. I would say the canteen because of the ginseng chicken. Oh shit, this is a beautiful slice, man. Thank you. Cheryl, can you do slides as nice as this? No, it's too hard. What's your favorite place in Anya's business school? Oh, um, I guess it's the Mota Radio Beauty. Because it's very modern and it's very clean. So, this is Lennon. He's one of my business classmates that I met in year one, Hi. semester one. Probably one of the first few people I met in business school. So surprised. What? What is this intrusion? brings me to the end of this vlog in terms of showing you the kind of different facilities that are at NUS Business School. I guess at the end of the day, regardless of the kind of facilities that are at any kind of school, the most important thing actually to me are not the nice facilities that we have, but more so of the people that you surround yourself with. So I've been very, very grateful to have met so many great friends at the NUS Business School. And it's really in such kind of environment where you see different kinds of people with different kind of goals, and you embrace your differences in terms of pursuing your own interests, whether it's finance, marketing, operations management, or any other majors. So each of our majors brings out different strengths in us and I think that's the beautiful thing about NUS Business School. Although we are one faculty, I like interacting with people over here because there are just so many perspectives which uh, broadens your palette in terms of seeing the world through their eyes and experiences as well. If I were to be very cliche, the best facility or surrounding that there is in the NUS Business School is the kind of people, the friends that I've met and the kind of memories that I've formed over here in the past four years. So that's it for the vlog for today and I hope that I've showed you a little bit about the NUS Business School which is slightly interesting. And yeah, that's it for this vlog and see you in the next one.